Hello and welcome to our channel Mockup Art. Today we have a jersey mockup. If you want this mockup, link can be found in the description. So let's get started. Now first we need to select the individual part. Uh, we are going to use the paint tool don't forget to change the shape mode sometimes in photoshop it, it will be a path mode so you just need to change the shape mode and click on the edges of this just click here and there remember one thing at the time of selection or the rough selection try to minimal on the points if you are going to make too much point it will be very difficult you to handle it Now the rough selection is ready so we are just going to curve those points click on them and use this adjustment you can use the keyboard key down arrow up, up arrow or you can also click on just move this mouse using the point move this points using the mouse
now the base for our image is ready so we are going to select the other part same process paint tool will be used so if you think uh, how am i how just i uh, copy it from the base image you just have to click the selection sorry control click on the selection and use control j so it will be make automatically a copy quite convenient As you can see same process is applied here too, just make a copy of the pant part or the trouser part. Also I can use this selection to create another copy for the upper part. So you just have to use the inverse selection. So going for the details, those round necks and hand area will be separate. Also the paint will be used here. As you can see the I have used rough selection for the outside area but I am trying to go precisely on the inside area because wraps uh, the outside area is totally transparent so I can easily mask them out but inside we have different objects and layers so we have to precise on them. use control shift and click so it will be select the multiple area and select this pant insert and use control j so it will be make a copy of them 
now put all those selection in a particular folder the inside area is remaining same process select it and delete it now go for the rectangle tool it will be our smart object create one for the t-shirt and one for the pant portion right click on them and just convert them to a smart object now we have to mask the area so just click on the mask and use the brush tool make the background and foreground color to black and white and clean up this area same for the pan portion We have to clear the inside too. We have to make the pen little up. right click on it and convert to a smart object select the pan portion control plus click and mask it out color as the way you want we are going to use the solid color layer select those individual area whenever you need now this is our base image so we are going to project those design on the color so make three copy of them name them light midtone and shadow turn those other layer off make these two liner burn make mid tone to liner dodge add go to adjustment change the level reduce the light go to light portion make it screen adjustment levels reduce these levels
place the smart object as the way you want Color those areas as the way you like. You don't have to go as I am going with the colors. You can change any color with this. So now for the background part, create a solid color layer. You can also create a gradient color if you want. now our design is ready so thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe for future updates